everyone, welcome to another season of Ego High. Today, we'll be discussing about the process through which you can acquire genuine property here in Lagos, Nigeria. Before I proceed, if you are just watching me for the first time, welcome to my channel and kindly hit the subscribe button to get first hand information about properties, property talks, property secret and many more. Buying a property can be exciting and scary at the same time. This is so because of the mix of fraud involved. So here I will be guiding you, I'll be giving you guidelines to take to acquire genuine property here in Lagos, Nigeria. Number one, budgeting. You need to have a budget. You need to have a budget. Let's say from 10 million to 20 million, from 850 to 1 million. You just need to have a budget before you can think of acquiring any property. Which takes us to number two, which is the core in getting a property. Location. Location. Location determines the appreciational value of any property. It determines how fast it will appreciate in value and how fast development will get there. Imagine you buying a property facing the beach, beachfront property, or buying a property facing the expressway. This property begins to appreciate in value faster and developing things to get there faster than properties to buy inside. Which takes us to number three, which is title. Oh yes, for this title, a lot of people, oh, I want to buy a land, C of O, C of O. I keep hearing C of O, C of O. Even people don't even know their other lands title. We only know of C of O. Yes, C of O is a very good title as you can use it to acquire loan from the bank. But we also have other good title, good title like we hold a set, a session, C of O, governor's consent. In our next video, I'll be going deep into all these various land titles we have in Lagos, Nigeria, which takes us to our next step, which is getting a professional realtor. This is also very important because this realtor will lead you to the company. Will lead you to a good company and will also protect your interests. This will lead us to the next step, which is who are you buying from? Who exactly are you buying from? If you are buying from a good company, they will protect you from all of the issues, all of the struggles, all of the wire of Omanule. In a case whereby you buy a land from Omanule, you will pay for foundation, you will pay for roofing, when you are even set in the block, you pay for it. But all of this, you won't pay for it. The, the company will protect you from paying all of this. You won't even have any experience with Omanule. And also, when you buy from a good company, even if you buy a land that doesn't have a good title, the company would help you to perfect the title. So also, we move to the next step, which is the, can I put it, the main, the main, the major process. Before you can acquire their genuine property, you've always wished for, which is verification land verification or property verification in a case whereby you want to acquire a land you will need the service of two professionals which is the surveyor and the lawyer the surveyor will go to site to take the coordinates and take it down to Alausa to verify the the, the owner of the property to know if 
truly it's the company that owns the property and to know the current situation of the property if it's under a session if it's having a session whatever the title the company is giving the surveyor would go to allow us to make sure that this this title coordinates is actually the same thing with what he saw as Alausa. So once this is done, he will transfer the information he got down to your lawyer. Your lawyer will come to the company to check the original copies to see that the company has the original copy of the documents. For instance, let's say you want to buy a land it's a session so your lawyer will go to the office to see that the company has the original copies of the, that particular property that is in a session because there are some companies they would tell you something else and then the document will be showing you is another thing entirely so once this is taken care of and the title is the same with what the, the, the company told you it is, then you can now move to filling of the form and FAQ. FAQ is frequently asked questions. This states the terms and conditions that the company is giving you. So once you fill the form, you are satisfied with the FAQ, then you can move on to transacting with the company. But in the case whereby you are not too comfortable with the FAQ, then you speak to your lawyer. The lawyer speaks to the company and they, they, they draft an agreement between you and the company. And this agreement is stated, it will be stated into the contract of sale. When this is done, then you can move to transacting with the company. This note that you should only pay into a corporate account, not an individual account. So once this is taken care of, the last stage is taking possession. You can take possession through the seat. The company would issue the seat of payment to you and contract of sale. And once you're done with all your payments, the company would send you allocation letter and then you'll be given physical allocation where you see where your land is where it falls from social hand to another hand so that is all in acquiring genuine property here in lagos nigeria in our next topic i'll be taking you through the various land titles we have in lagos nigeria so i come your way next time my name is Precious from Ellis Homes and Properties Limited, always here to bring to you unbeatable real estate deals you can count on. See ya!